Hi, I'm Charlie Meyer reporting for Hingham Broadcast News. We're here at the Lincoln Sailing Center on Hingham Harbor. The current $7 a foot fee for vessels 17 feet and longer moored in Hingham Harbor will remain the same for the coming boating season. However, as part of an effort to raise additional revenue for the Harbor Master's Department, Harbor Master Ken Corson has proposed that the fee be charged on vessels equal to or greater than 13 feet. Corson also recommended that the world and mooring permit fees be increased from 250 to 350 per season. The selectmen have approved this increase. The Harbor Master's Office has been working with the state to create a mooring optimization plan for all the town moorings. The mooring areas will be organized, vessels grouped by size and type, and each mooring will have a specific GPS position. This will generate new revenue for the town, Harbor Master Corson said. It will provide the most efficient use of the mooring field, including the creation of additional transient slips and a dinghy dock. Corson has also been working with the task force and the Harbor Development Committee with input from the public to formalize the town's waterways regulations into one comprehensive document that would require selectment approval under the town's harbor bylaw. There would be a corresponding modification to the harbor bylaw to make the bylaw and regulations consistent with each other. A harbor bylaw change requires a town meeting vote. While the Harbor Master's Office has broad authority under state law to enforce state boating regulations, the town is authorized to adopt its own bylaws and regulations consistent with the state. All town departments have been asked to come up with 5% cut budget scenarios. The Harbor Master's budget has been historically underfunded, Corson said, noting that, 2000, that since 2008 the budget has decreased by 35%. Several assistant Harbor Master positions have been eliminated, and the full effects of last year's cuts haven't been felt yet, according to Corson. Not restoring the Harbor Master's budget to previous levels would result in the elimination of the pump-out boat, decreased revenues due to the lack of manpower to enforce regulations, and inability to initiate new revenue streams. The increase in mooring fees in 2009 generated 180000 double the revenue from the previous year. These revenues are needed to compensate the department for services provided to the boaters and community by the Harbor Master's Office. For Hingham Broadcast News, I'm Charlie Meyer.